I uh, can't say that I was really surprised. Uh, I thought uh, that many of the top lieutenants would probably be indicted. Naturally, uh, I think it makes it all the more important that those of us on the House Judiciary Committee now try to get to the truth of all of the allegations concerning alleged presidential misconduct, particularly because uh, some of his top people were, you know, so involved. I mean, are things perhaps going to move faster? I think that it will because I uh, believe that some of the barriers have now probably been lowered with the return of the indictments. In other words, I don't see, I don't see the same need on the part of Judge Sirica to uh, try to uh, maintain the strict uh, confidentiality or secrecy of the grand jury proceedings. And it's been my belief all along that we could probably get a hold of all of the extraneous materials like the tapes and documents anyway, even though uh, we could not get a hold of the uh, grand jury transcript. Well, now you feel you might get more material now from the grand jury and from the special prosecutor's office. Is that pretty yes. plain in your mind? Yes. I, I really look for a, uh, an attitude of cooperation. I think all along that uh, both J Jaworski and the judge have wanted to cooperate. I think they have felt inhibited because of the uh, pending grand jury proceedings and, and indictments had not been returned. Now indictments have been returned, so I, I would guess that uh, there would be a kind of a new spirit of cooperation. Congressman, has the point been reached where this thing has got to be settled one way or another? Yes, I, I really believe that. I think the American people want to get to the truth of the whole sordid Watergate affair. I, I don't think that we should presume anybody guilty. I think everybody's innocent until proven guilty. But I think that it, it really behooves us to try to get to the truth. And I am very optimistic that the House Judiciary Committee will be able to do that. And you're issued to the judge. Uh, the reports are, and they seem to be pretty firm, that it does concern President Nixon. Do, do you feel that that's right, or, or what should be done with the report now? Well, my feeling is we should not, on that score, jump to conclusions. I, uh, however, believe that uh, the judge should turn over that report if it is relating to alleged presidential misconduct, which is the subject of our investigation. I think we should have access to that material, and particularly if it's going to help us uh, wind this thing up, because I think we've got to expedite uh, our inquiry. As a key member of that House Judiciary Committee, uh, do you have any perhaps inside knowledge on that report? I mean, are you pretty certain it deals with the president? I really do not, and I have only, uh, I've only heard the rumors and the, uh, some of the statements that have been made by the press, but I have no uh, personal knowledge at all.